Hey YouTube, it is me, Zevadar here, bringing you a great solo commentary. Ooh, guys, this is a good one. A way to start off summer 2011. Get pumped, let's go. Last night, I became a champion of baseball for my league. The Babe Ruth League, my last game in my little, little league, not my little league, I want to call it little league, my uh, baseball career, with, like, you know, excluding high school or school leagues. Um, and anyway guys, we won the championship in the most epic form ever guys. You cannot write a movie script more perfectly than this. And guess who scored the winning run? Yes, yours truly. Guys, it was intense and I will explain more about it. But basically, I'll give you some background information. Um, our playoff system works, um, double elimination. So that means that the only way that you can be, um, taken out of the playoffs um, is if you lose two games. Not in a row, if you just lose two games flat out. Um, and so, that's why it's double elimination. Um, and so, you know, our regular season record was, um, tied for the best, 10-4, and four, I think, or 12-4, and four, something like that. We have four losses, I mean, double-digit double digit wins. It was awesome. And so we tied with another team, and the, that other team got out very, very quickly in the playoffs, which I was thrilled about even though one of my best buddies was on that team. Anyway, regardless, we're in the playoffs. We lost one, but we I'm on the White Sox. Um, I was on the White Sox. I, I was proud to be on the White Sox. And we played the Dodgers. And um, so the way it worked was Saturday and Sunday, since the Dodgers haven't lost a game and we have lost a game in the playoffs, um, they only had to win one game to take, take home the championship, and we had to win two games to take home the championship. And, um, so, yes. First, I'm going, so Saturday and Sunday were the two games, and they were both night games, which was a like very, 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 sorry guys, very, very, very rare thing, night games. And, um, you know, they drew both 7 o'clock games, and it was just awesome, it was under the lights at the varsity field at our, for our town, and it was awesome, guys, and so we went into, um, Oh, no, hold on. I gotta explain one more rule. There's one rule in our league that says if one if you throw one pitch, like let's say Monday, you cannot throw Tuesday. You cannot pitch it Tuesday. So if you pitch one game, you cannot pitch the next day. And so the first game we have this amazing pitcher who uh, pitched the whole seven innings. We won't, we only played seven innings. Um, he pitched all seven innings. It was awesome, guys. And so they pitched their best pitcher on Saturday too, and we ended up winning. And so we knew that on Sunday, he couldn't pitch their best pitcher, and so we actually had a chance. I mean, we had a chance the whole time. I mean, we had a better chance, if that makes sense. Um, I mean, moving on. So we won. We win Saturday, and so we need to win Sunday for the championship. That's for all the marbles. So on Sunday, um, you know, it was a very very cool game, tie game. No, I'm sorry, not tie game. What am I saying? No, guys. We were down seven nothing going into the fourth inning. We score seven runs to tie it. Boom! There you go. Four, fifth inning, they score one. Now going into the seventh inning, they're still up eight seven. Wow, guys, it just got more intense after that. Okay, bottom of the last inning, our two, our three and four. Yeah, our three and four guys were up because I, I bat sixth in our lineup. Um, so our um, three and four guys were up, and they struck out. So this is two outs, bottom of the last inning. <laughs> yeah, bottom of the last inning. Yeah, guys, get this. So our next guy up, you know, he's a decent hitter, but he can run. He can run. Oh, my God. So this guy got walked, and so then, then I'm up, you know. I'm acting all, you know, yeah, let's do this, you know. And so I'm up. Then the guy on first, our runner, steals second base. Wow. It was intense, guys. And so then the next pitch comes in. I swing at it. So grounded to the second baseman. I looked at myself like, oh, my God. What did I do? Because then he throw to third base for the last out. Nope. He bobbled it like it was a hot potato, guys. Oh, my God. If he bobbled it anymore, Lord, I don't think he could. So the guy on second base scored. So that's a tie game. I'm on first base. Yes. I was like, yes, let's go. That second baseman felt like, you know, a piece of... C R A P. Um, anyway, guys. So then, 
The next batter up gets walked. That's push, uh, blah, 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 blah. that puts me on second base. All right. Then the ne- after the next couple pitches, I don't know how because I am not the stru- I'm not the fastest kid ever. I mean, you know, not the fastest kid. But anyway, guys. So then this next pitch. Usually when you steal base, you steal like when the ball's in the air going to the toward the catcher. But the ball was already in the catcher's hand, and I decided to steal. I don't know. There's some force in the universe that had me stealing. I stole that base like there's no tomorrow. The catcher threw to the third baseman like it was a joke. And then I landed on the third base's third baseman's ankle, and I think I broke it. I honestly think I broke it, and if you're listening to this, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think I broke it. This kid was whining and crying on the ground. I don't blame him because, you know, having me land on your ankle is pretty rough. Anyway, guys, I was safe at third base. <sighs> Winning run 90 feet from home to win the game. All right, guys, next pitch, next pitch, pass ball from the catcher. I run home. I make a beeline to home plate. Right, guys, this commentary is coming to a close. I know, but then I run it. I slide. Safe. We win the championship. Guys, it may seem fake, but it is real. Let's go. (sighs) Wow, guys, you know where it's at. I stole home. My teammates mobbed me. We got our trophies. We went to dinner. And oh my god, guys, I cannot believe what happened last night. I felt like such a champ. This is my last game in the... Oh my god, guys. The <laughs> oh man, it was a great series. It was a great 11 years playing, and I will continue, guys, to play. And I promise you guys this commentary, so there you go. Guys, thank you very much. Pumped 2011. Let's go. Summer 2011. Get pumped. Yes, sir. Please like, comment the video if you enjoy my story, guys. I love that story. I don't know about you guys, but anyway, guys, peace out. I'm about to go to the Red Sox game. Go Red Sox. Let's go. Summer 2011, get pumped.